Uh, I can't. Of all the crap. Of all the crap. Oh, we've been through this for the fourth time now. <laughs> I've dealt with your crap already, and I'm tired of it. Jesus Christ. Can't even get to Mount Moon. <laughs> um, be a male this time. All right, what are we going for this time? Um, oh, oh, crap. Um, hold on just a minute. Um, Ember. Say that again. Ember. Why? Because it's it's a synonym for ash. Uh, no, no, Cinder. It's a synonym for ash. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Um, we're probably going to have to fix this sometime down the line because OBS seems to be crashing after. Like, one hour of recording. And I, I literally don't understand why. I, I'll try and give it an update and see what happens. Thorn! Thorn? Yes! We're going synonyms this time! He is a thorn in our side, I'll give you that. All right, here we go. Do we run to Jake Antimax again? I seem to work out fine that time. So yes. Uh. Recall. Well, now we know what it does. Now we know how to do it. Uh, let's not do it this time. All right. Goodbye, Mom, again. Goodbye, Mother. I miss my running shoes already. <laughs> oh, wait. There's Pokemon in this forest. It's unsafe. I just uh -oh. wanted to kill myself, Professor Oak. Why didn't you just let me? God knows. If it's not Mount Moon, a Buzzwall will show up or Brandon will <laughs> jinx us for some bullshit like that. I'm sorry for bringing up Buzzwall. Of all the things, too, of all the things we've talked about, right, it's that. That's what shows up. It could have been any of the 858, or 98. 98. And it was that. Ew. No. Okay. Is that a JoJo pose? Ooh! If only that would evolve sooner, but that might have Dragon Rage. Ooh! So, it I would say either Gumi, who is Dragon, or we go with the uh, Water Samurai. That looks like a JoJo pose! I mean, maybe. Ooh! Uh, Goo. Well, Gumi. at the same time, right, imagine, if we pick the Gumi, he gets the Water Otter. If we pick the Water Otter, he gets this ugly-ass beetle bug. So, Gumi evolves into goo du mm -hmm. It's a Goo Dragon. Goo Dragon. And... What's the Water Samurai? Samurai. Well, it'll become that. It's a Duat, right? but it'll become a Samurai. Uh... Do... Like, D-U-O-T-T? D-E-W. Like, running uh, D -E -W. do. Oh, D-E-W. Okay, okay. Uh... Duat evolves into Oshawott. Uh... Evolves into Samurai. Oshawott is the previous form. Oh, 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 um, Samurai, Samurai. Ooh, um, 
I am leaning more towards the duot, but if you want the Gumi in a hand. I I'd rather give him a bug. Okay. It's kinda why if this was in the other order, it'd be Gumi. But because I'm giving him a shitty bug, I'm okay with it. Okay. Also, we're named Cinder and we're picking a water Pokemon. Somehow, this feels like a bad idea. <laughs> can I can I suggest one? Um, after you do, I would like to suggest one too. Due uh, to a reference that might go over your head. I'm going to say Yokozuna. I was going to go to PB and J. I know that reference. I disagree. He is not any of the right colors. Okay, but you do know what I'm referencing. I do. I know the show. And I don't know, like, if Rachel watched it and I was, like, secondhand watching, but Yokozuna sounds good. I want to go with the, uh... With the Emperor slash uh, uh, Samurai sounded name. Well, I may be wrong here, but wasn't Yokozuna a, a, a sumo? I could be. Is it Zuna or Zuma for ours? And Zuna. Yep, then Yokozuna was a very, very famous sumo wrestler. Well, now we got a samurai named Yokozuna. Oh! Push he was at speed up? That's not bad. Poison po Ooh! Okay! Alright! He was, he was actually in the WWE as a... I, I don't... I don't know enough about him... It makes a lot more he... sense now that I'm thinking about it because I remember that name specifically from Ed, Ed, and Eddie, and I know how you feel about that. But there was an yeah. episode where they were scamming people into, like... It, they were scamming a kid into being a sumo wrestler because they say, like, sumo wrestlers are famous, and then Double D would just come in from the side in Japan every time. Like, <laughs> he would have to specify in Japan like it's the fine print from a fucking contract. Okay, now that, that joke, I mean, like, most of the show, I didn't enjoy the humor of it, but that set, like, that offhanded thing, like, pointing out fine print, that is kind of funny to me. Like, every time Eddie would talk it up, Double D just pipe in, yeah, in Japan, just huh. every time, it was great. It literally got to the point, like, because they called Ed with, like, a single D. They called him Yokozuna Ed. He's what they had Jimmy <laughs> training against. Hell, they got Jimmy so fat because they kept feeding him food. Because it's like, you gotta be fat to be a sumo wrestler. That they're like, alright, cool, we're gonna make this happen. We're gonna, like, stick him on a teeter-totter and jump on the other end and fly him to Japan that way. <laughs> you can imagine how well that went. It knows Peck. That's weird. But he's poisoned now, so I'll take that. Okay, okay. Um, Actually, Yokozuna is a highest rank in professional sumo wrestling in Japan. Oh, even better. He's okay, named so named after the guy. Yeah. Oh, uh, no, the guy is named after the rank. Oh, it's reversed. Okay. Yeah, because he's an American professional wrestler who called himself Yokozuna. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, I thought it was a Japanese... I mean, I thought it was a real sumo wrestler named Yokozuna instead of a rank of Yokozuna. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I know Yokozuna... Was, Ooh, that'd be fun. Was paired with 
sumo in some way. I kind of want to catch that. That's a fun one. Is that a sand ghost? Yep. And it turns into a castle in its evolution. It is a haunted so sand castle. So <laughs> But I don't think we'd ever get it. Mm. Gojira. Yeah. He's so pretty looking. Oh my god, like this is one of the bad things about a Nuzlocke. You're like, look at all the Pokemon that I can't I have. Yeah. I will take all the XP, thank you. Yes. All the Pokemon I'm not allowed to capture. <laughs> there, there. I beat God! How did I lose to a Buzzwall? <laughs> How did I lose to a goddamn mosquito with muscles? just not fair. And I think it's a good thing that we finish within like the like one two minute mark within the last episode of this because I can easily just tack that on to the end. Mm -hmm. Of all the and of course, of course it's the one where we're like, oh, there's not a mosquito Pokemon. It's literally what kills us. Yeah. What is this irony of bullshit? RNGs, <laughs> why? It, it, it would have worked too if it didn't keep using power up punch. Yeah. Uh. If it would have done any of its other moves instead, we probably would have been fine. But it kept using that and buffing itself as it hit us. Uh, With the one uh, typing that we were weak on both of them for. Mega Ring, Z Power Ring. Man, these look familiar. That'll never be used. And Z moves. Uh huh. Is. Are those, like, extensions of our own techniques? What do you mean? Like, fire spin becomes, like, super fire spin. Yeah, kind of, but you can only do one of them per battle. Ah. Uh, and where is that located? No idea, because we need to get the crystals for each element for that to work. Uh, what do we get? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Oh, I can only hope and pray this works out. Yeah. Or I just kill it! <laughs> oh. All that XP from before is biting me in the ass. Yeah. I was too strong. <laughs> well, Route 1's gone. Oh. On the upside, we'll have Pokeballs for the next dump. Next one. Besides yeah. that. Why couldn't we get you instead? You we could have caught, for sure. And I wouldn't have just used a water gun to kill you. Although it's my only damaging move, I've just realized. What about Tail Whip? That lowers defense. Oh. But I mean, it's level three. I could probably catch it right off the cuff because it's just an unevolved Pokemon. Yeah, I, I was thinking Tail Whip was a damaging move. Nope. Because there is Tail you're... Slap, which is. Oh. Although that came around in Gen Five. Oh. I wouldn't even know of it. So I, I, because Tail Whip, you're hitting something with your tail, mm -hmm. which may do damage. You would think, but no.
So, Yokozuna... Yokozuna may be good against Brock. It depends on whatever the hell he has. Well, let's put it this way. He won't be weak to anything Brock throws at us from attacks-wise. Yeah. Now, whatever the fuck these Pokemon actually are, who knows? Yeah. Take my potion. I'm gonna find my next Pokemon and maybe catch it. Maybe not. Something weak, please. Something that can actually get into a regular ball. What can I catch? Are you kidding me? Also, that's a Dynamax sprite. What is that? Let's see if it should. Alright, good. That looks badass. Like, what typing is that? Looks like it's water. Oh. By the way, uh, if you didn't know, this guy's based on James Bond. Really? Yep. I like him low, so maybe. We doubling up on water, but whatever, I'll take it. I'm not gonna complain. Don't be a Lapras. Don't be that guy. Get in the ball. Come on. You know you wanna. So it's seen. So it is a. Oh boy. Final evolution. Yep. This, uh, well, we got this turn, maybe one more, or he's dead. Okay, come on. Hopefully. Nope. No. Nope. Not even one. He might be dead here with that poison. He's very dead with this poison. Uh oh. Sad. I like Ten. poison point, but it's backstabbing us right now. Yeah. All right, let me go heal. We'll try Route 2. Are we going to have to solo this with a single Pokemon? Is that what's going to happen here? Maybe up until we get Mount Moon. Yeah, until we can get that Magikarp, quote-unquote. Yeah? I mean, if nothing else, freaking Yokozuna here is going to be massive. That, yeah? That level is going to be huge. Yeah? Gonna be like level 20 by the time we reach Brock? I mean, the way this is going so far would not shock me. Alright, old man, what are you gonna catch this time? What has replaced Rattata in your eyes? <laughs> Alright, you're getting a bird. And Sweelo seems to be early game. Well, it looks early game to uh, me. Final evolution of an early game bird, yes. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Gen 3? Yep. Okay. You know, you could just give me what you caught. That'd be nice too, wouldn't it? Yeah. I wouldn't complain. I've only got one Pokemon. <laughs> route two. All right, route two. What do you got for me? Something I can catch, please. That is something I could catch. Intrepid sword. Okay, interesting. All right, we're just going, we're balling it. We're going right yeah. into the balls. Hey, yeah. what do we got for a sword snake? Uh, he does evolve into what we call Sandaconda, so. 
Um. Oh, I forgot to read the back sentry. It's a girl, by the way. Ooh. Oh. How would I spell this? How would I spell this? How would I spell this? Um. B L A D Y. Blady. That'd be Blady. You'd want the E in there. Okay, then Blady. I feel like that's a little too on the nose, though. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, um. Wait. Can, what? Can, mm, what about Slithord? Or Slithlor? Or Slitherbolt? No. I'm trying to com com like com combine Slither and Lord. Uh, hold on. I may have one here. Uh, what was her name? What was her name? What was her name? And what is the etymology of that? Uh, okay, uh... Oh, Boa Blade, that would be good. If, if I'm pronouncing this correctly... Sabella. S-Z-A-B-L-Y-A. It is Hungarian for Saber. Alright, I like it. S Z, you said? Yes, S Z A E L Y A. L. Zabilia? Would be Ye how I'd pronounce that? Yes. Right. Zabilia. Zabilia. So I disintrepid sword just raised the attack stat? Is that all it did? Yeah, it raises attack upon entry. Uh, special attack up, speed down. Ah, oh, I would have liked that reverse. That'd been nice. Uh, sand attack and wrap. It does not have much to work with. But that is fine. It is something. Uh, because there was a recent female sword-wielding common rider named Sabella, and supposedly... Since they were all named after some kind of blade, that's where she uh, probably got her name from. <laughs> what do we got in here? Something to catch? Maybe. <gasps> I'm okay with this. Let's see. Oh, does this have what I think it might have? Oh no! We might be in trouble. Take it, it out! Lear. It is Lear. It is Lear. Sand attack. Let's sand attack it into oblivion if we can. So that way it'll just miss. No, it doesn't. It gets wrap early. That's what it has. I don't think it has dragon rage. Although, if this is in here, this might be something that the, the bug catchers have. So wait, do, will Dutini have Dragon Rage? Eventually. I don't think it gets it right away, though. Start top lobbing balls at it. Yeah. Alright, it's lob balls.
Come on. All right. If Rap hits it one more time at the end, it's over. Oh, uh, come on. Nope. Does it get released or not? It does. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Now I can worry about healing. Actually, I'll worry about swapping out. Because we'll throw out Yokozuna. You'll be able to take more of this, and then we can just start keep we can just keep lobbing the balls. Yeah. All right, Pokeball. Damn it! Uh, oh, come on! You got one job, and that's to stay in the freaking ball. Come on. Work with me. Yes! Alright, alright. Uh, We're actually gonna fight Brock with third Pokemon for a change. Uh, wait, how do I fam how do I feminize this? How do I feminize this name? Crap! How do you feminize Trogdor? Oh for Christ's sake. The dragon, Dratini, the dragon Pokemon. Even the young can exceed six and a half feet in length. It grows larger by repeatedly shedding its skin. Uh, I'm not naming it Trogdor. Fuck that. I know it's female. We're not naming it a female version of Trogdor. I refuse. Why? It because needs it doesn't get muscly arms or wings. <laughs> it needs a strong and powerful name. Trogdor is not a strong and powerful name. Yes, it is! Go back to the drawing board. Trogdor! No. <laughs> I am shooting. I am vetoing that immediately. Try again. Frender! I hate you. <laughs> I would only accept that if this was a dog. We find a Growlithe, fine. I'll begrudgingly do that. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Vodka? Can I ask your logic? I'm not opposed, I'm just curious. I. I. I don't know what made me just think that. Genie out, sucking on potatoes? Is that what's happening? Maybe. Is he a drunk? I have no idea if she is a big consumer of overripe potatoes. I mean, she just, you know, she's out in the field just sucking on potatoes. I can't help it. It's just what she okay. does. Okay. What is, what is her ability, actually? We don't even know. Oh my god, I had one HP. Oh wow. Quiet nature. So special attack down or special attack up, speed down. Oh, chlorophyll. Okay. So if we make it sunny, it gets a speed boost. Rap and leer, that's all it's got. Do you want to give her a potion now? I'm taking or him back to the Pokemon Center. Okay. I'm getting a full heal on everyone. Okay, okay. We were a little bit closer to the town than I thought we were. Mm, we only just got in the forest. Okay. Alright, well. Uh, I can't complain too much. That's that's not bad, considering what we put up with in the last two tries. At this yeah. Shit. Yeah, I will, and I will not say anything. Yeah, don't jinx us. 
Yes. Uh, so, but I think um, it's about time. Yep, next time we will face Bjork again. Again, again. Again, again, again. Oh my god, this was. I'm enjoying this Nuzlocke session. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm having more fun with Nuzlocke than I thought we would. I, look, I'm just saying. You. Is it because you've jinxed us? Is that what it is? Is that why it's so fun? No, it's like. Just the sheer craziness. Like, I've only watched, like, one Nuzlocke, and that wasn't a 898 Nuzlocke. That was just a, a I think, basic Nuzlocke. So, so I don't know, like, the sheer insanity that this can get. Mm-hmm. Let's just delete this one more time, just to be sure. Yeah, so we'll catch everybody on the next episode of Nuzlocke. Third attempt edition. 